Italy has a long history of different coinage types, which spans thousands of years. Italy has been influential as a coinage point of view. The florin, one of the most used coinage types in European history, was struck in Florence in the 13th century. Since Italy has been for centuries divided into many city-states, they all had different coinage systems. But when the country became unified in 1861, the Italian lira came into place and was used until 2002. Today, Italy adopts the euro currency. History Ancient Greece and Ancient Rome Spite the fact that the first Italian coinage systems were used in the Magna Graecia and Etruscan civilization, the Romans introduced a widespread currency. Unlike most modern coins, Roman coins had intrinsic value. While they contained precious metals, the value of a coin was higher than its precious metal content, so they were not bullion. Estimates of the value of the from 1.6 to 2.85 times its metal content, thought to equal the purchasing power of 10 modern British pounds sterling at the beginning of the Roman Empire to around 18 pounds sterling by its and an, over the same period, around one to three days pay for a legionnaire. Middle Ages and Renaissance Florin The Florin was struck from 1252 to 1523 with no significant change in its design or metal content standard. It had 54 grains of gold. The Fiorino d'Oro of the Republic of Florence was the first European gold coin struck in sufficient quantities to play a significant commercial role since the 7th century. As many Florentine banks were international super companies with branches across Europe, the florin quickly became the dominant trade coin of Western Europe for large-scale transactions, replacing silver bars in multiples of the mark. In the 14th century, 150 European states and local coin-issuing authorities are made their own copies of the florin. The most important of these was the Hungarian forint because the Kingdom of Hungary was a major source of gold mined in Europe. Early modern history The early modern Italian coins were very similar in style to French francs, especially in decimals. Since it was ruled by the country in the Napoleonic Kingdom of Italy, they corresponded to a value of 0.29 of gold or 4.5 grams of silver. Papal States Scudo The Papal States Scudo was the coinage system used in the Papal States until 1866. Between 1798 and 1799, the revolutionary French forces established the Roman Republic, which issued coins denominated in Biocco and Scudo. In addition, the states of Ancona, Civitavecchia, Clitano, Foligno, Gubbio, Pergola and Perugia changed their coinage system to that of the Roman Republic. In 1808, the Papal States were annexed by France, and French francs circulated as the official coins. When the Pope's authority was restored in 1814, the Scudo was restored as the currency. However, the coinage of the individual states was not resumed. In 1849, another Roman Republic was established which issued coins centrally and in Ancona. In 1866, the Scudo was replaced by the lira, equivalent to the Italian lira. The exchange rate used was 5.375 lira equals 1 Scudo. Parman Lira The Parman Lira was Parma's official currency before 1802, and later revived from 1815 to 1859. The Duchy of Parma had its own coinage system until it was made a part of France in 1802. This lira was subdivided into 20 soldier, each of 12 denarii, with the Cessino worth 6 denarii and the Ducato was worth 7 lira. The currency was replaced by the French franc. After the re-establishment of Parman independence, the Parman currency system was introduced in 1815. Also called the lira, it was subdivided into 20 soldier or 100 centisimi. However, this lira was equal to the French franc and the Sardinian lira, and it circulated alongside the latter. It weighed 5 grams, and had a purity of 9 tenths of silver. 
Since 1861, Palmer has used the equivalent Italian lira, Neapolitan piastra. The Neapolitan piastra was the most common silver coin of the Kingdom of Naples. In order to distinguish it from the piastra issued on the island of Sicily, it is referred to as the Neapolitan piastra as opposed to the Sicilian piastra. These two piastra were equal but were subdivided differently. The Neapolitan piastra was divided into 120 grana, each of two tornesia or 12 cavalli. There were also the Carlino worth 10 grana and the Decato worth 100 grana. Two Sicilies piastra The two Sicilies piastra was the coinage system or currency of the Kingdom of the Two Sicilies between 1815 and 1860. It was subdivided into 120 grana, each of two tornesia. Accounts were kept in Decato, worth 100 grana. Sardinian lira The Sardinian lira was the currency of the Kingdom of Sardinia between 1816 and 1861. It was subdivided into 100 centisimi and was equal in value to the French franc, which had replaced the Piedmontese and Sardinian scudos by 1799. It was replaced at par by the Italian lira. Tuscan Fiorino The Tuscan Fiorino was the currency of Tuscany between 1826 and 1859. It was subdivided into 100 quattrini, with an additional denomination called the Paolo, worth 40 quattrini, in circulation. Lombardy Venetia Florin The Lombardy Venetia Florins were the coins of Lombardy Venetia between 1862 and 1866. It replaced the pound at a rate of 1 florin equals 3 pounds. The florin was equivalent to the Austro-Hungarian golden, although it was subdivided into 100 soldier rather than 100 cruiser. Austrian coins circulated in Venetia. The only coins issued specifically for Venetia were copper one-half and one soldo pieces. Modern period The lira was made the official currency of Italy in 1861 after the Italian unification, however stopped being used in 2002. The euro coinage system entered circulation in Italy in 2002 and is currently the official currency. Lira upon the creation of the Kingdom of Italy under Vittorio Emmanuel II, a unified lira was established. At 4.5 grams of silver or 290.322 milligrams of gold. This was a direct continuation of the Sardinian lira. Other currencies replaced by the Italian lira included the Lombardy Venetia pound, the two Sicilies piastra, the Tuscan Fiorino, the Papal States scudo, and the Parman lira. In 1865, Italy formed part of the Latin Monetary Union in which the lira was set as equal to, among others, the French, Belgian, and Swiss francs. In fact, until the introduction of the euro in 2002, people speaking the Gallo-Italic dialect in northwestern Italy usually called Frank the lira. World War I broke the Latin monetary union and resulted in prices rising several fold in Italy. Inflation was kirked somewhat by Mussolini, who, on the 18th of August 1926, declared that the exchange rate between lira and pound would be one pound equals 90 lira, the so-called quota 90. Although the free exchange rate had been closer to 140 to 150 lira per pound, in 1927, the lira was pegged to the US dollar at a rate of one dollar equals 19 lira. This rate lasted until 1934, with a separate tourist rate of one dollar equals 24.89 lira being established in 1936. In 1939, the official rate was 19.8 lira. After the Allied invasion of Italy, an exchange rate was set at $1 equals 120 lira in June 1943, reduced to 100 lira the following month. In German-occupied areas, the exchange rate was set at 1 Reichsmark equals 10 lira. After the war, the Roman Mint first issued the first 1, 2, 5 and 10 lira coins. 
They were officially set up on 21 December of the same year and were used up to 1953-4. The value of the lira fluctuated. Before Italy set a peg of $1 equals 575 lira within the Bretton Woods system in November 1947. Following the devaluation of the pound, Italy devalued to $1 equals 625 lira on 21 September 1949. This rate was maintained until the end of the Bretton Woods system in the early 1970s. Several episodes of high inflation followed until the lira was replaced by the euro. The lira was the official unit of currency in Italy until 1 January 1999, when it was replaced by the euro. Old lira-denominated currency ceased to be legal tender on 28 February 2002. The conversion rate is 1,936.27 lira to the euro. All lira banknotes in use immediately before the introduction of the euro, as all post-WW2 coins, are still exchangeable for euros in all branches of the Bank of Italy until 29 February 2012. Euro The euro officially began circulating in Italy on 1 January 2002. Italian euro coins have a design unique to each denomination. Though there are many themes of works by one of the most renowned and famous Italian artists and painters, each coin is designed by a different designer, from the one cent to the two euro coin there. Eugenio Druti, Luciana de Simoni, Ettore Lorenzo Frappuccini, Claudia Momini, Maria Angela Castle, Roberto Mauri, Laura Cretera and Maria Carmela Colaniri. All designs feature the 12 stars of the EU, the year of imprint, the overlapping letters RE for Repubblica Italiana and the letter R for Rome. There are no Italian euro coins dated earlier than 2002, even though they were certainly minted earlier, as they were first distributed to the public in December 2001.